I'm Katha Mackey with Terrier Vision here with Coach Foltz. Tell us what this early win against the Citadel means for the team. To be honest, you know, I, I thought we needed to play better. You know, our coaching staff talked a lot about us playing better, and we came out tonight and played really well uh, in terms of getting the first one. It's always important to get the first one, so it's, it's good to have one out of the way. One two pitch coming, runners on first and second. Swung on and missed. Adam, you play strong for the Terriers tonight in the conference play. Tell us what you're doing to lead the Terriers down that path. Yeah, so we uh, we talk about a lot about trying to keep it simple on the mound, um, one pitch at a time. Kind of our, our philosophy is to execute the next pitch. And, you know, I really tried to just try to be an example of, of what that is, of just focusing one pitch at a time. I mean, it, it's it's something that sounds so simple and easy, but it's it's pretty tough to do, and I struggled. We all struggle to do that, but, you know, I just I just try to go out there and be an example for what we're trying to do out there and, and uh, kind of show show the young guys the ropes of after being through it for four years. You had nine strikeouts in seven innings. Tell us your feeling up on the mound tonight. Yeah, I mean, it felt good. Anytime, anytime you walk away with a win and, you know, you're, you're able to contribute to it and you don't have to be picked up by a teammate or something like that, like, it's, it, it's awesome. Um, but, I mean, with that being said, like, there's no way could have gone – Whatever those nine strikeouts without Cody Miller back behind his, uh, the plate catching catching his tail off. Um, our defense uh, continuing to just you know stay ball first and continuing to you know making plays behind me and just making it very easy to be able to have that success. It's I mean as, it's on, as much on them if not more on them than it is me. Half of your outs tonight came from strikeouts. Tell us about the pitchers' outings. You know Adam had nine, and he'll tell you himself he doesn't go chasing strikeouts. You know he goes out there and gets ahead in the count. Uh, gets one, two, and then throws a lot of competitive pitches, and then we get the bonus of the strikeout. Elmeyer came in and was down in the zone with his fastball and has a really good all-speed pitch. So usually when you're doing those two things, you'll get a couple strikeouts. And it helps the defense. You know, it helps the defense take a little pressure off them. So it's great. The throw home. Called strike three. Ninth strikeout of the night. Pitch, a bunt down the first base line. That'll score a run, and nobody at first base, it'll be a hit. My counts one walk. There's a little bouncer over the mound. Second baseman handles it over to first, in time for the double play. <laughs> Against Thomas Bilek, and there's a drive to left field. That ball's well hit, and that ball is gone. Home run. Andrew, you had a solo home run tonight with two RBIs. Tell us the offense tonight. Well, we started off slow and didn't have a lot of good at bats early, but um, as the game progressed and we got later into the late innings, we uh, ended up hitting a lot of balls hard, uh, executed a lot, and we were able to get uh, five runs across. On the other side of things, tell us about the defense tonight. So the defense was really good. We um, That really helps when we have a 5 nothing lead, and it helps keep the, keep the game in our favor and keep their runs down when we're making plus plays and uh, just making all the routine plays. No matter who you are. And there's a drive to center field, going back, back, back. It is a, did he make the catch? He did, what a catch that time by the center fielder. That was Davis with a diving catch. You only had to use two pitchers tonight. Tell us the importance of having the whole bullpen the rest of the weekend. Extremely important. Uh, you know, we knew after our midweek game, we used a lot of our bullpen. So we knew that, you know, Garcia was not available and Hirschman had thrown a lot. Uh, on Wednesday, we used a lot of arms, so it was great for Adam to give us a good start and Elmeyer to finish the game, and then you know, going into tomorrow, we have all of our arms ready to go. Here it is. Swing and a miss, and that's the ball game. So Elmeyer closes out the game.